Oh! There's sooty and sweet and the corsu and little cousin Shem. There'll be fun galore with the terrible boar. Just you wait and see. It's sooty and company. Sooty and company. Oh, no, not the watchdog. Oh, no, not the watchdog. Not the watchdog. I'm not a number, I'm a free man. I'm not a number, I'm a free man. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Didn't notice there for a minute. I expect you're wondering what I'm doing. As you might well. Well, actually, you see, I'm a big fan of an old 60s programme on the television called The Prisoner. It was great, and I've got all the memorabilia. Look, mugs, I've got badges, T-shirt, been there, done that. But best of all, I've got an actual clip of the programme. Watch this, watch. Oh, yes! Oh, fantastic. Brilliant. Look at that. Oh, yes, the watchdog, the watchdog. Excellent. Absolutely excellent. And this thing here, this is like the watchdog on the programme. Except, of course, the one on the programme was much bigger and much more menacing, and it patrolled the beach, and it stopped the prisoner from escaping. What on earth are you doing, Matthew? Poof. Sue? Sue, where are you? Here, Matthew, on top of the door. Whoa! Sooty, Sue, what are you doing up there? Oh, it was Sooty's idea, Matthew. We're doing a spot of mountaineering. We've scaled the mountain, and now we're on top of the world. So, today, Sooty and Sue are into mountaineering. And it looks as if their friend little cousin Scampi is, too. Gosh, but that's a long ladder he's climbing. It doesn't seem to bother him, though, does it? Scampi is obviously a born mountaineer, as sure-footed as a mountain goat. He's like a trusty Sherpa who's born to climb. Oh, oh, I don't think. Let go, let go, let go. It's all right, I think I've done it. I've given them the slip. This gives number six a chance to escape. <laughs> the watchdog! I'm not a number, I'm a free man. I will need my strength if I'm going to escape. Must escape. Must escape. Must escape. Must escape. Look at that! The watchdog! It's here! Just a minute. I'm not holding it. It's real! Matthew, of course you're not holding the balloon. I what? am! <laughs> what a silly boy you are. Fancy being afraid of a little balloon. Yeah, all right, sir. Well, I'm glad it's you. Just a minute. Is that thing full of water? No, of course it isn't. But Excellent. it is actually. Dum, 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 dum. I'm not a number, I'm a free man. I'm not a number, I'm a free man. Dum, 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 dum. I'm not a number, I'm a free man. Uh, Matthew, I was going to say that it wasn't full of water, but it was full of talcum powder. Thanks, Sue. Thanks a lot. What is that noise? Oh, uh, that'll be Sooty finishing off his mountain. Oh, fine, his mountain. His mountain? Hmm. Well, Sue's right. Sooty has built a mountain. And a very, very impressive one as well. Come on, says Sooty to Sweep. Let's climb it. <laughs> I don't like mountains, says Sweep. But this doesn't put Sooty off. And he starts to scale the north face. <laughs> Steady there, Sooty. Steady. Whoa, whoa. He's nearly there. Easy. Take it easy. He's nearly there. He's nearly there. And he's done it! Oh, that is fantastic! Uh, he's reached the top. Come on, says Sooty. If I can do it, then you can too. I don't think I can, says Sweet. Oh, let me, let me, says Scampi, hardly able to contain himself. All right, says Sooty. You can have a go, but for goodness sake, be careful. So little cousin Scampi is having a crack at Sooty's mountain. It's all very tense. Yeah. Steady there, Scampi. Steady. Easy. Easy. Oh, and he's made it! Oh, yes! Scampi is on top of the mountain and on top of the world by the looks of it. Look at him bouncing about. Uh, Scampi, Scampi, I should be careful with all that bouncing, otherwise you might... Uh... Oh, dear. 
poor little scampy. I don't like mountains, says Sweep. Oh, come on, Sweep, says Sooty. Don't let a little accident put you off. Go for it. Go for it now before you lose your nerve completely. Come on, Sweep. You can do it. I can't. I can't, says Sweep. Nothing you can do will make me get up there. Hmm. But Scampy has other ideas. He's got a sharpened pencil. And he's about to see if Sweep meant what he said. One, two, three, go! <laughs> doing? You're a mountaineer? Oh. You love mountains? Yes, so really. does Sooty, and so do I, and so does little cousin Scampy, Matthew. Uh, just a minute, hang on a minute. I've just had an idea. If you lot love mountains mm -hmm. and I love the prisoner, mm -hmm. then there's only one place for us to be. Hey, where's that, Matthew? Whale Sue. Welsh type Wales. Come on, Scampy, get yourself cleaned up, I'll get cleaned up, and then let's go to Wales. Now, as you probably know, Wales is famous for its mountains, so that lot are fine. But Port Merion is famous for something else, because this is the place where they made my favourite TV show, The Prisoner. The town hall was the administrative centre of the village in the TV show. Sooty's standing in front of the building that was the home of number six in the show. It's now a souvenir shop. This building is called the Pantheon, and in the TV show, it was called the Green Dome, the house of number two. And this is the Port Merion Hotel. In the TV show, this was known as the Old People's Home. And this is the famous beach where that balloon thingy kept the prisoner in the village. Come on, let's go and have a better look, shall we? The Port Marion village was built by the architect Sir Clough William Ellis between the years 1926 and 1972. Port Marion is near Port Maddock in North Wales and is a popular and well-deserved tourist attraction. Right, come on. All this sightseeing is fine, but you want to see some mountains, so we'd better make a start. You two set off, and I'll stir up sweep and scampy. All right. Come on, off you go. Oh, and you don't have to hang around, by the way, because I'll soon catch you up. It's great here, isn't it? Right, sweet, come on, let's be having you. <laughs> Scampy says we should take something to drink. Well, actually, that's not a bad idea. All right, come on, then, let's have something to drink. Well, pretty good idea, really. Oh, excellent. Well done, that's good. Good, 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 good. OK, uh, that's, that's probably enough, actually. That's probably enough. Please, please, no, 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 this, this is silly. Crying. No, 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 please don't, 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 don't cry. All right, all right, it wasn't a silly idea, it was a very good idea, yes? <sighs> Have you got a bag? Right, thank you, thank you very much. Right, I'll just load these up, put them in the water in the bag. OK, here we go. What, Scampi said we should take some sandwiches? Well, yeah, that's not a silly idea. All right, let's have some sandwiches. Sandwiches are good. That's two, that's excellent. Three, one each. No, we don't want... We, we, look, please, we do not want... No. Look, stop. Stop. This is just stupid. Oh, all right, all right. It's not a stupid idea. It's a very good idea, OK? Come on, what? Matthew. What's keeping you? Yeah, all right, so I'll be with you in a minute, OK? Scampy thinks we should take a sleeping bag. A sleeping bag? I thought we were going on a walk, not an outward bound course. Sleeping bag. All, all, all right, all right. Don't, please, please, don't cry, don't cry. All right, we'll take the sleeping bag. All right? Yes, yeah, give it to me. Right, all right, all right. Jolly good. Well, we've got the sleeping bag now. Anything else? Hmm? Scampy thinks we should take a radio. Well, uh, oh, in case we get lost. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Go, go and get it, then. Little tiny radio, in case we get lost. Just so we can contact... What's this? Just a minute. This is a ghetto blaster. I thought you meant a little, little tiny... We can't possibly... Matthew! What? We'll make our way to the railway station. We'll see you there, all right? 
look, 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 for the last time, look, we do not need, we do not need a string of plastic fruit because it's... Uh, get, uh, get, all right, all right, all right, we'll take it, we'll take it. It's, it's good, it's good. Oh, look at this lot. All right, you two, if you're quite finished, we'd better go and catch Sooty and Sue up. Uh, the power of tears. God. Well, if they think that I'm going to carry all this lot on my own, they are very much mistaken. Because I am going to get the... the oi! 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 Come on, Sooty. This is the booking hall for the famous Festinio Railway. Tickets for us, please, and two for our friends, Scampy and Sweep. Thank you. Isn't this nice, Sooty? The others shouldn't be very long now. I'm here, at last. Gotta get a ticket. Gotta get a ticket. Gotta get a ticket. I'm sorry, we're no longer open. What? No longer open? But I must get a ticket. I've got to join my friends who are, who are, who are on this train. I'll have you know I walked miles trying to catch that wretched train. Anyway, those smarty pants will be sorry when we meet up again. Because look what I found. Look, look. Ha! Mountaineers! Do you remember Sooty and that lot saying how much they like to climb mountains? Well, they're stuck on the railway, so they can't. I can. Or I could if I wanted to do. Actually, I might have a go. Depends on my feel. Excuse me. I couldn't help overhearing you. Did you say you were going to do some climbing? What? Me? Yes, I uh, heard you saying you might have a go. Yes, sir. I mean, I might. I might just uh, scuttle up to the top of the mountain and then uh, scuttle back down again. You never know. <laughs> no, well, that's great, except uh, you can't climb if you don't have the right clothes. What? Oh! Oh! Oh, what a shame! Oh, Dash! Oh, darn! What a shame! I was just looking forward to a good climb then as well. Oh! Oh, yes, I would have shown you a thing or two. But, uh, well, got the wrong clothes on. So, you know. <laughs> I can't! <laughs> what on earth are you doing here, Sooty? I thought you were on the Festiniog Railway, hmm? You fancy doing some climbing? What? Oh, well, yes, sir. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I fancy doing some climbing as well. I mean, I, I fancy doing some climbing, but unfortunately, uh, well, got the wrong clothes. Tja! <laughs> Wouldn't you know it, eh? Oh, yes, it's a shame, that. Because... <laughs> What's this? Well, looks like you're equipped for climbing now, so go ahead. What? I can't. I, I mean, I... I, I mean, I, I mean, I couldn't. I mean, Sooty... Well, y you can go first, because if you can do it, then I certainly can do it.
That wasn't bad. It wasn't bad? What do you mean it wasn't bad? It was brilliant! Sooty, you're a genius! Just a minute, just a minute. What are you lot doing here? I thought you were, I thought you were playing trains. <laughs> oh, you wanted to watch Sooty doing some climbing? Well, actually, you can do better than watch sweep. You can actually join in. Now, come on, because you love mountains, don't you? Mm? You're frightened. <laughs> Wimp. Hey, what about you, Sue? You're not frightened of mountains, are you? Well, no, not when they're at the shop. But I have to confess, this is a different matter, Matthew. I don't know how Sooty got up there. I'd be terrified. <laughs> Another wimp. And what about you, Scampy? Hmm? I mean, you're not afraid of a little rock face, are you? You are. As I thought. Cowards, all of them. Not one of you brave enough to go up the rock face. What about you? Are you brave enough to climb the rock face? Yeah. Actually, it's not as dangerous as it looks. It's only about six metres tall. Yes, yes, yes. I'm up. I'll do the climb. Not that face. That's for little ones. You're climbing that face. <laughs> <laughs> It's all right, we see a lot of this sort of thing here. I've already dialed the mountain rescue team. Don't worry, Boyle. Help is on his way. Help! And don't you worry. Those mountain rescue fellows will be here before you can say Jack. Robinson. <laughs> hey, just look at that. He can relax so far as the mountain is concerned, but I hope he's got a good head for heights. Mm. Why? Mm. Because the RAF rescue helicopter is taking him down the mountain now. Oh. Say goodbye to him. Bye-bye. Oh. Oh. Bye-bye, Matthew. Bye. <laughs> oh. 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 